fruit has in general grown on all Danes for a while and with Noma's success and all that it's very hyped. We produce a lot of organic stuff in Denmark and a lot of restaurants are opening like middle class restaurants really worth uh, visiting because we are a lot of very talented chefs and uh, too many for a little city um, to have a Michelin star restaurant um, so a lot of the chefs have decided not to Bo and I met up at the uh, chef school we were both apprentices actually in the beginning we didn't like each other at all far from friends and then in the end we, uh, we joined forces and, and started having a combo. I think what brought us together was, was uh, that we realized that we, we matched really well together. Uh, the social act will be a temporary space um, opening up and shutting down uh, each two months. It will be a four day, five day period of time. Uh, the dinner was uh, built on nine themes. All of them are very crucial for us to, to uh, create this uh, unforgettable experience. Uh, the first one being fun. We had them suck on this tube that was you know, hidden soup with uh, buttermilk and then a very intense and fat oil made on dried mussels as well. Interaction is also very important. Um, the interaction part was, was, um, was starting to carve this table open, uh, discovering new flavors and, and light. And the flavors of the second dish were these small dim sums with a comfy made on duck hearts together with a creamy uh, onion puree. And the dip was made on uh, pickle jelly and small tapioca pearls flavored with horseradish. The function was at the bonfire, so it's about this functional design. And this uh, serving uh, was a very social way of, of serving food. You all sat around the bonfire and the sticks had these twisted breads. And then you had a small plate with a um, caramel, the dulce di leche, seasoned with a little bit of uh, sherry vinegar, and then some um, fresh lumpfish roe. Comfort food is, is for us uh, something very new and, and we really try to please our guests. So it's very tasty and it's very soft, it's very creamy, it's very rich, it's very warm, it's very easy to understand. There was this pork uh, braised for 12 hours, so it was very tender, with some crispy uh, pork cracklings on top. We want our guests to come back home and when they wake up in the morning still think about what they had the day before and not comparing it with another visit at a restaurant they had. But we, of course we want people to be happy and to be full, but uh, to have an unforgettable evening.